Hey guys, Ben's 499 Nerb here, and today we are playing Survival Island on Minecraft. So, pretty much, here it is. Alright, so pretty much, you spawn in on this world. Alright. What you have is... You have one tree. One little thing of reeds will collect these. And and then there is a giant cave system beneath us. So pretty much we are going to be playing on hard difficulty. And yeah, so I'm not sure how this is going to go. I've played it a tiny, tiny bit before. So yeah. Um, yep. Sorry if the quality is not the best. I'm recording this with Camtasia. Um, so yeah. But... So pretty much, we have some goals. I'm not quite sure what they are at the moment. Um, one of I know that it involves us making a two-story house, a cobblestone generator, an obsidian generator, a wheat farm, a pumpkin farm, a melon farm, a reed farm. A lot of farming going on. Um, so yeah. Yeah, I look like Bowser. I'm not actually sure how I got that. It kind of happened, though. Um, so, yeah. Um, for now, we're just gonna put our workbench down. We're gonna make some sticks. Alright, um, we'll make a wooden pickaxe. And then we'll go in the cave system and get some stone. Um, so yeah. So, we can use, um, the grass to collect seeds to get wheat. And then we'll plant this tree so that it will grow and we can have more wood. Um, so yeah, th th all this map really makes you do is pretty much utilize... It just it makes you utilize the game more, I guess. Like, you have to... You have to farm trees to get trees, you know? You have to do all kinds of stuff. And you're, another rule of the island is you're not allowed to leave the island. So... And by leaving the island, to me, that means we're not allowed to go swim off and find other land. That does not mean we're not allowed to go in the ocean. Because, you know, there's some cool... Oh, this is kind of cool. So, yeah, um, actually, I think this is an entrance to the, um, to the cave system. Just There's quite a few ways in, actually. Um, but, yeah, so pretty much we're going to be doing this. Um, I can make a stone pickaxe now. Oh, I never grabbed that stuff. I thought I did. Um, oh, we're also gonna... Actually, no. We're just gonna want to make a stone pickaxe because we're gonna be able to find... Oh, there is an Enderman. I do not know why he's there. Um, wow. Um, Enderman or... Ah, oh, gosh dang it! I didn't mean to make three swords. Where is he? Where is he? No, don't look at him. Hello. Oh, die, die. These things literally kill you in like two hits. No, 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 no. See that? Oh, 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 oh. Ah. <laughs> I don't know how you're supposed to like effectively kill these things with at, like the start of the game when you don't really have anything good. So, yeah, they have a ton of health. And I guess they're, um, like, I, I believe that, um, monsters or, you know, whatever you call them, enemies, mo mobs, um, I guess they were given more health in the pre release 3 of 1.9, which I'm playing on now, as you can obviously see. And I have no idea where this guy went. I actually have my render distance on tiny. And I believe if it's any higher than that, I'll not be able to record. So, yeah. Um, I have no idea where this Enderman is. It's kind of really scaring me right now. Let's try. Let's try up in the render distance. I don't know. Let's put it on short instead of um, tiny. I don't see him. Well, I guess he left. 
there get some seeds um we'll actually get a wheat farm going a little wheat farm going before we um actually we don't have any wood so we can't make a hoe or a shovel or anything because i accidentally made three swords that is just awesome um i thought there was two entrances to the cave um, I guess there's only one. All right. Um, so at the moment, I do not have any torches. Here is some coal, though. We will collect this coal. Ah, so yeah. Um, we have to make a two-story house, and by a two-story house, I'm. I have some own some rules of my own. I don't really have like specific dimensions for the two-story house, but for the farms, um, I think it's. I'm gonna oh wow. Um I'm gonna say it's considered a farm if there's at least forty plants there. So you know, I wanna have some pretty big farms. I don't wanna have like um you know, like two like you know, like plant one seed and say, Oh well I got a wheat farm going. So yeah, um I don't really know. I'm pretty sure that since there's this cave system here, we have access to everything. Is that a creeper? Oh, okay. The Enderman came down here and died. That is actually very cool. Not sure how that happened, but I have an Ender Pearl now, so that's cool. Um, in the 1.9 pre-release, Ender Pearls actually have use. Like, um... Wait, I can make more sticks. I have planks. I am so stupid. Um, but yeah, um, they actually have use. You can throw them, and wherever they hit, you teleport there. You do take some damage, but you teleport there. So it's actually pretty cool. Um, the Ender region is going to be coming out soon, I believe. And there's going to be Ender dragons, which... That's going to be crazy. I don't know exactly how that's going to work. Like if they're going to be like extremely powerful or what. But but yeah. They seem to. Seems like they won't be all that easy. That's all I'm thinking. Uh, <laughs> and I am lost. I think that this is the way that I am not supposed to be going. I think that this is the way back. Especially with torches. I honestly... Okay, yeah, I know where I am now. Because this is where the Enderman died. And then down here... Ooh, coal. I mean, iron. Yeah, this is why I only made one um, pickaxe. Because there's actually quite a bit of resources. Ever since, I think, 1.8 came out... In my opinion, the game got a whole lot easier. And I think a lot of people agree with me. Um... Like, you find iron and even diamonds so much more. Like, when I first played this game, it was, like, alpha. It was in the alpha. It was, like, early alpha, too. It was, like, 1.12 or something. I got it, like, a week after C Nanners made his first video. So, pretty early on. I'm not quite sure how early on that is, but... Um, but, yeah. Oh, there's a zombie that I'm not going to kill, because zombies drop nothing of what am i doing okay that actually ended up being beneficial but um yeah zombies drop nothing of importance really they drop rotten flesh which you know if i'm hungry enough i can't eat it but generally i will not be eating rotten flesh because it gives you that stupid food poisoning and stuff and i'm just gonna go ahead and build myself up rather than you know, later on, I will get some other stuff. But how did the Enderman spawn? Don't... Can they spawn in any light source? Like, I didn't think that, like, the hostile mob spawned during the daytime. I don't know. Can I do anything with this? I actually think I can make, like, an Eye of Ender and make some kind of crazy potion out of it. But, but yeah... Um, let's see. I need to make some... Make these into sticks. Alright, we have 17 sticks now. 
And we need to make like... Alright, we have thir Whoa, what is going on? Alright, um... 32 torches, and we need to make a hoe.